What's going on, guys? It's your boy Rob Lee back with here another video. Got my man Pipe in the building, man. Mike. Hey yo, Scale yo, up. we just well, we just ran into some crazy shit. Oh, he's in the studio, just chilling. And we ran to this nigga. His nigga name is 645AR. I, I I don't know how he says his name, but this man apparently he's a squeaky voice rapper, bro. Yeah. And yo, I and then he has a genius video for his squeaky voice song that we just bumped. So we're not even gonna do a reaction to that shit. But we're gonna do a reaction to this shit. And fuck it. Other than that, yo, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Give me a like if you like the video. Well, Let's get IG. into it. I'm only Mike. Papa Mike, all his shit will be in the description too, yo. Let's get it and see yo. what this this has got to be funny. Yo. I do the squeaky voice, but nothing sweet. A lot yeah. of people, they think it's like funny, but like, you know, with me, it's feeling in it. You know, yo, like, there's what? a lot of emotion in it. Like, when I go high, just stuff that's really going on, like, out here in the streets. Oh. So, you know, I just, I just want like people to feel what I'm going through. Yo, this guy funny already. Shit. So I was in the studio with my boy Tony Snow and we made this song called Crack and I was just playing around. I was like trying to do something commercial so I did like a high pitch and I didn't even curse in the song and then that's just how it started. The song was right. produced by uh, David Morris, Backwoods, and Sensei T. Hold up, real quick, yo. As a rapper, bro, this shit pisses me the fuck off. Just, just the. Y'all see what the fuck I'm talking about. Yeah, me and Sensei go way back. Like, Sensei's my go to guy, so. That's that, and then like David and uh, Backwoods, that's just where we was at that day. So like, we ended up all working. I was just trying to get them familiar with my new sound. Cause like, I did the squeaky, like, I dropped the project. And when he say squeaky, like squeaky, like the nigga, yo, he really, he really believe in this shit too, yo. <laughs> he really believe in this squeaky shit. It was like just me rapping. So I was trying to get them familiar with this new singing. So I dropped like two songs, and then like For the Child was the second one. And then it just took off ever since. Hey, here we go. <laughs> Hey, yo. <laughs> yo, nah, yo. Hold the fuck up, yo. Hold up. So I grew up in the Bronx, and uh, I was staying on Jackson Ave. It was 2006. One time I was going to school, <laughs> and it was just body in the lobby. Like, it was sitting there for like a while. So my mom saw it. <clears throat> she was just like, it's time to get up out of here. So then we moved to Florida. So I was I was moving around a lot because I was in Florida for like a couple months. Then I moved to Atlanta. It reminds me of who I am. So I remember those days. Those yeah, shut the fuck up. Yeah, yo. <laughs> hey, yo, you, you imagine seeing him in the club. Like, hey, yo, you the nigga that do the squeaky voice, right? Hey, yo, yeah, how you gonna respond? Like, yeah, yo, I don't know what to do the squeaky shit, yo. Yeah, yo still like, yo, do that squeaky voice for me right now, bro. Do that squeaky voice for me right now, cuz. Uh, <laughs> yo, <laughs> rap to me that squeaky yeah, shit, yo. yo. yo it sound like Alvin and the Chipmunks. <laughs> Hey yo, that's the meme gonna put up, yo. I'm gonna be like, this nigga spitting. Like, <laughs> uh, Those hard times made me who I am. You want respect? Go get you a stand. Do you think so? Me? Yo, no one that. What the fuck did nigga say? Hold Pause. up, yo. Hold up, yo. Pause. Three dicks on me. Pause. I understand what he's saying. They're trying to talk about the, the 30 clip. In the nah. I would never nah, call Nah, you could've just said sticks. I don't understand why they You could've just said that. sticks. I, I don't participate. You can't first squeak in your songs, then say some. So me feel no one that. You know, in the hood, man, like you just want respect. Like, man, you gotta go get you a step, whether it's a check, you know, it's a body, or just, you know, something like you want respect, you gotta go get you a statistic. So when I say three dicks on me, you don't know one of that, because, you know, I really move around dope down. So it's like, you know, two of those, and then you hold over the other one that, you feel me? Really? It's just standing and, you know, just a lot of people just laughing and, like, jokes, you know. And yeah. I really made a check off a voice for my niggas in the trap. So, you know, I'm just happy to say that. Bruh, yo, he's like, he's trying so hard, yo. <laughs> People wasn't showing love, but you know, I never cared because I always stuck to my plan. I had a task that I was trying to yeah. reach, so I was just locked in. So, like, all the outside noise, it didn't bother me. It never did. That's what it comes with, you know? 
Be careful what you wish for. Ooh, 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 ooh,